What's up guys, hello and welcome, my name is Nick Burnham and this more nostalgic one, and uh, today we're going to be playing some Tavern Brawl. The fourth button has finally opened. The gates are open for uh, Hearthstone today, and uh, if you haven't heard about Tavern Brawl, it's going to be a weekly thing, there's going to be a new Tavern Brawl every week, and it's going to be totally crazy, it's kind of a super casual mode with like, uh, different rules and different uh, deck specifications every week. Sometimes maybe they'll give you a deck to play with, uh, different heroes to play with. I have no idea what we're going to go into, but I'm really excited to find out. So let's do Tavern Brawl. Yeah. Welcome to the Tavern Brawl! Welcome. Showdown at Blackrock Mountain. The two epic bosses of Blackrock Mountain are settling things once and for all, with your help. So I think you can do this once a week? I'm, I don't think you can do it more than once. You win a pack for your first victory? Oh, maybe maybe you can do it more than once then. Okay. Let's try it out. I don't even have to build the deck, so... This will be against somebody else online though, of course. And, uh... This is so new that I don't even know if anybody else is going to be playing this right now, but we're going to try and find somebody. Okay, here we go. I believe this just opened up in the last couple hours, so... I'm so excited. Um, a lot of people thought this was going to be a tournament mode or something else, but I, I'm glad they added something more for casual players, and I think my game died. Maybe? I hope not. Alright, we heard the clink. Phew, we found somebody. <laughs> Game almost crashed there, I think. Ragnaros versus Nefarian. Huh. I am the master here. Wow. I will have my revenge, Dragon. So I'm guessing um, the game randomly picks which hero you're going to be. So I got Ragnaros this time and he got Nefarian. Uh, we can take out some Flame Strike. Looks like Ragnaros is kind of a Mage Shaman type character. Do we keep Lava Burst? Nah. I'm gonna keep Corrin though. So yeah, these are some of the cards from the Black Rock Mountain uh, Adventure. Or some of the characters, and they've actually been turned into real cards. See, Moira summons Emperor Thorasan now, which is amazing. Uh, these Korhan puppies. I saw some of these. Um, cards already. I wield the power. Actually. Uh, how did he play that? Oh, he starts with five mana. Holy shit. Um, add a random spell from any class into your hand. Just kind of like the actual Nefarian card. Uh, we've, we start out with Sulfurus. Uh, it has death rattle. Your hero power becomes deal eight damage to a random enemy. So the regular Ragnar's enemy. But we have 60 health. He has 30 armor and 30 health. Pretty similar. Um, I won. We could summon a Magma Rager, which seems kind of bad, or we could play this Living Lava. Probably the best bet. And I think I just want to hit him in the face, because we want to get rid of this hammer as soon as possible. Summon a Magma Rager isn't great, but could be worse. He's going to get a spell. I guess you can't pick the card back for this, but... Cone of Cold. Gonna turn down the sound just a little bit more. Okay. Just for my sake. Uh, this is really good. But all we can do for now is summon a Magma Rager, I think. So, here we go. So far, so good. Uh, Corrin Dire Brew always wins brawls, and his battle cry is he gives a brawl to you. You get a brawl in your hand. Okay, so he had to trade with the Magma Rager. That's really good for us. The Son of the Flame is really awesome. Deals 6 damage, battle cry. Okay, so he has a dragon deck. I guess we should have expected that. Um, deal 6 damage, seem is really good. Three charges left on the hammer. Which, I'm guessing this is Sulfurus right here. <laughs> I didn't know the name beca before because I'm not a, a WoW player. Not really, anyway. Um, 
Shadow Flame. Wow. That seems wrong. So if he's getting random spells... Oh, it's random spell from any class. I thought it was a spell from my class, but it's from any class. Okay. That makes more sense. Um, do we get a Brawl? Or do we summon the Corhound puppies? I mean, Brawl's going to come in handy this game no matter what, right? 4-8 is really good. Yeah, let's go for it. And uh, he always wins the brawls, so... I mean, we could foreseeably play this next turn. Fight. And Heroic Strike. Wow. I think we're doing okay, though. Okay. Um. Well, we could just do Son of the Flame and Core Hound, I think. And a Magma Rager. Or the Whirling Ash. That sounds good. Um. Oh, that's why my spells cost less. It was because of the Electron. I totally... It was like, why are my spells costing so much less? I'm dumb. I should have played the Korhan puppy spell first. Oh, well. First Tavern Brawl of the week. Or first Tavern Brawl ever, actually. <laughs> so. Obviously. Oh, don't lock up, please. Okay. Zero mana polymorph. Jesus. Yeah, and that... And that Spell costs zero, whatever he gets, so... Wild Girls, he gets to draw a card. I'm kinda glad I have this deck. This is the more aggressive deck. <laughs> For sure. Also damages the minions next to him whenever he attacks. So he's like the Faux Reaper, 6,000. Another Shadow Flame. So he does not have much to play with right now. He's got no cards. Well, except for that one spell. Or whatever he just drew. Um... So we can do Moira and the puppies. So these guys are pretty cool. At the end of each turn, you summon all Corhound pups that died this turn. So if you can get... If you can uh, pull this off, it's pretty awesome. So yeah, now we have the better, much better hero power of doing 8 damage. I think we're in pretty good shape, but... How am I to know? Magmatron. When a player plays a card, Magmatron deals 2 damage to them. Okay, that's not bad. Um, this guy's awesome. So High Justice Grimstone st uh, summons a legendary minion at the start of your turn. Which is pretty amazing. We can just trade here. Um, I think. So what we want to do? We just trade. Yeah. Sorry, right, two damage is not not a big deal. Now we get rag or now we get Thorson, so that's a lot better. Six mana flame strike. One mana six six taunt. <laughs> it's pretty good. But you know, you never know. He could get some really awesome spell and just destroy us, so he could get Twisting Nether for all we care. Yeah, see, look at this. Quality. And another bite. Yeah. Zero mana spells are no joke. For sure. But he's got no dude, so... Um, Baron Geddon is not very good for us right now. So we'll play the High Justice and the Lava. And hit him for eight with the Hero Power. So far, so good. Uh, I hope this guy lives. I really want to see what we get to summon. I really want to play the other deck now. Maybe if we do Tavern Brawl again, we'll get that deck. But... Arcane Shot. Okay, so he has a dragon. Oh, there you go. How much damage do we have? Depends on what we summon here. Ooh, ATC. Too bad we don't get the battle cry. Uh, I could just flame strike. 
4, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 damage. I think we want to just flame strike and hero power. Seems best. And then we'll trade one puppy in. Because we're going to get him back. That's fine. Might as well play the flame out. Pretty sure we're going to win at this point. I think he made some poor decisions. I think he used some removal on some guys when he didn't have to, but I don't know. Maybe he just got really unlucky. This definitely felt like the stronger deck this game, but you never know. All right. So. Look at that. Won our first tavern brawl. And we got a pack. Let's open that pack. I want to play as the other side now, for sure. Cool. Okay, so you can keep brawling as long as you want, I guess. That's your prize, though, is the the first win. I don't know if that's always going to be the same prize, but hopefully we can play as Nefarian next. Let's see what that deck is all about. Not bad, I got a Violet Teacher, which I don't have yet. I can deal with disenchanting those later. Uh, let's try and get a Nefarian, that would be super cool. If it is random. Ragnaros seems like the more powerful deck, but... Maybe we can win with the other one. Who knows. There we go. That worked out better. Nice! We got it. Okay, so this is the more, definitely the more controlly type deck. I have big dudes though. Player plays a card, Magmatron deals 2 damage to them. Give your minions plus 3 attack. Open the gates, we can get rid of. We'll keep the Electron probably. Although it helps him out too, which is unfortunate, but um, I want some cheaper spells to play, or minion, minions to play off the bat. Two Chromatic Drakes and the uh, Draconid Slayer, okay. Can work with this. Oh, I forgot we start out with four mana, I'm dumb. I was like, I need cheaper things so I can play stuff, but didn't really. Let's see if he knows to attack. Okay. So he did that correctly, at least. Uh, we can play Magmatron. Seems really good at the beginning of the game. Or we can play the Slayer. Nah. And we don't want to give him access to more mana, so... Seems really good. We're just going to keep playing. Maybe, like, the key to this deck is using your hero power whenever you can, but... On this first turn, I don't think that it's, that it's that important. Maybe he'll just play Magma Rager and pass. I kind of feel like we have to go face with this deck, but I'm not entirely sure yet. There we go. Alright, so we don't have to trade with the Magma Rager. Uh, if we got a really good spell, that would be nice. Um... Yeah, let's roll the dice here. Arcane Shot. That's actually perfect. I get it. I have to take two damage, but it's not a big deal. Um, I'll play Chromatic Drake. Magmatron, mad. Let the games begin. I'm just trying out these emotes to see what they are, but. I should have tried more when I was... Well, everybody it seems probably knows Ragnaros is probably less familiar with uh, Nefarians. He's got a much larger health pool, but I don't think he has any way to get health back. Um, at least not when I played the deck. So we can bite. 
the Sun of Flame and coin out another Chromatic Drake. Seems good. We're gonna take a lot of damage. Oh no, we don't have the Magmatron anymore. It's like, we would have taken a lot of damage if Magmatron had survived, but not a big deal. True Chromatic Drakes is pretty scary, I think. And we can start using the hero power a lot. See, this deck seems like it needs more ways to draw cards. So I'm running out of steam now, already. But I've got 14 damage on the board, and he doesn't have anything, so... Hard to say which deck is better at this point. Seems pretty balanced. Okay. We can deal with that. He's just gonna hit us in the face. Yeah, there's kind of a clock against Ragnaros, too. It's like... Ooh, that's pretty good. Um, so we can play the Draconid. Let's see what spell we get. Snake Trap. It's pretty good. Yeah, because if he... If he attacks the Chromatic Drake with either him or the Magma Rager, then we'll get the snakes. So we might as well play that. And I could play the Slayer. I think I'm going to go with the Whelps. He might have Flame Strike, I guess. But he's a little bit farther away from that. We definitely don't want to play Electron, then, if he has Flame Strike, because that'll give him access to that. Um, so I think we want to play the Hatcher. Let's see what he does now. Like, we know Flame Strike is in that deck, at least. <laughs> So, better to play this guy early, I think. And the poor Blackwing Technician, I'm afraid, might not get played, but... This... What to burn first? What to burn first? Let's see what he does. Of course, I kind of filled up my board already, so we're only going to get two snakes, huh, if he attacks. I think that's how that's going to work, but whatever. What to burn? Oh, now he has a brawl. That's not good. Um, and he always wins brawls, huh? So we have to kill Corrin. Uh, which we can do pretty easily. So we can do this and this. I guess I should have seen what spell we were going to get first. I'm dumb. Uh, Farsight. Toxitron. At the start of your turn, deal one damage to all other minions. It's kind of... That's pretty bad for my turn, but it is free. Um, I think I'm just going to play the Slayer. Yeah, Toxitron just can't, seems bad, especially since he's on his last uh, hammer charge. If he plays that one card that summons, that fills his entire board with 2 2 whelps, then I guess we can play Toxitron, but even that isn't gonna kill them all, so. I don't know. I kinda like playing with these, uh, the robots from the adventure, though. I thought that was one of my favorite um, challenges in that adventure was. Uh, can't remember that guy's name. But he had all the, the robots, obviously. The Trons. <laughs> So what, how much damage do we have? 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. That's okay. Get the 1-1. One, one. So now we do want to fill up the board more. Um, we want to spell Fireball. <laughs> Would be super nice. Uh, okay, so we can bite it and Blackwing Corruptor. Oh, we don't have a dragon. Shit. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh, well. Um, so we have to trade this. I'll just play... 
I think we can play the Toxitron now. Just to get more creatures on the board. He's probably dead. He could have Flame Strike now, but. Just trying to avoid damage from his hero power. Or at least kind of protect the Draconid and the Chromatic Drake, so. Oh, I forgot he had a Brawl. I'm dumb. Don't hit the Corruptor? Electron is really bad for this deck, because the spells I have cost zero anyway, right? So It's kind of weird. Demon Wrath is good. Let's play both of these. Now we've kind of run out of stuff. So... I don't know if we can win. <laughs> Depends on what he can do. I played right into that brawl, which is unfortunate. Ooh, lucky. Nice. Okay. We need some good spell... Uh, we need some good RNG with the spell power, I think. Oh, we have opened the gates too, huh? Ice block. Uh, it doesn't help us, unfortunately. Should we open the gates? If we open the gates and he flame strikes, we kind of lose. Uh, I don't want to kill off Moira yet. But we can't even push through the living lava right now. Um, costs three less. So we could play Electron and open the gates. I guess that's okay now. This could be really bad, but... Um, so I think we just play Open the Gates and... Well, what does he do? I think we have to run the Corruptor into here. And then do that. Oh, I should have played Demon Wrath, huh? Do we have to trade? Yeah. <laughs> Instead of saying it, Instead of, like, saying oops or something like it, he just, like, laughs at you. Flame strike? Yeah. He's kind of afraid of that. Hit me. Fuck. Yeah, I don't feel like... I feel like the Farian's deck is worse. <laughs> Getting a random spell is a lot worse than doing eight random damage, I think. And now we can't even kill the Core Hound with Bite. So we could go face... Fireball, maybe? Okay. We're okay. We got a nice block. So we have a few turns left, I think, to draw some kind of damage. And when I was playing that deck, I didn't have any way to heal, so... Okay. All the pups are out. Might win. This is definitely the harder deck. No question about it. Chromatic Drake. Not helpful. Oh. Hey! We could get really lucky. So we Demon Wrath and Avenging Wrath and hope that he it hits the face three times? It seems really bad. Especially since it's giving gonna give him Core pups, it might just totally whiff. I don't think we have a choice though, and if he keeps playing more minions, it's just gonna get worse, so. Uh, I guess we have to do this. Just hope. Come on! Nothing. Yeah. That went really badly for us. <laughs> oh, RNG Jesus. You'd think with eight chances... Oh, he does have armor too. You'd think with eight chances would have hit him at least a couple more times. <laughs> oh, well. He's actually going to kill the Chromatic... Well, I guess he has to. He has to kill the Chromatic Drake, but his board's going to be full of hounds. Anyway, so... Yeah, that card is really good if you get... If you have two of them. We're not dead yet. 
We got like two chances if he can't, maybe three if he can't break it. Oh, duh, he can break it. Okay. So we have one more chance. We need to, we need to get fireball or crackle or something off the spell power. Ugh. Garbage. Counter spell. We had a good run. I think the worst mistake I did was playing into the brawl, but I think we would have lost anyway. So I don't know, it's hard to say. Wow, it takes forever to die. <laughs> Whatever. So I think we've decided that Ragnaros definitely has the better deck. Uh, but Nefarian can win early if you drop enough of the big guys and put out enough pressure. Um, but yeah, that's Tavern Brawl, and I hope you guys enjoyed that a lot. I'm, I definitely loved it. Uh, definitely going to play this some more and um, come back every week for a new one. So I've been Nicker Nostalgic One. Please subscribe and like if you enjoyed this at all, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!